with over 7 million monthly listeners and sold out concerts all over North America, the band Wallace are slowly becoming the newest up and coming indie pop band. The band consists of Dylan Minnette, Braden LeMasters, and Cole Preston. The three members met while enrolled in the Giz Masters program at Keyboard Galleria Music Center. The band formed in 2011 and has gone by many names until settling on Wallows in 2017. From then on, they were on a steep uphill ride to the top of the indie charts. In April 2017, the band released their first single, Pleaser. Silence is what I do best Still I hear it all Wasting time around my head So I talk to myself The song eventually reached number two on Spotify Global Viral 50 chart and number one on the KROQ Locals Only playlist. The next month, they released Suntan and began playing packed shows in the Los Angeles area. Their quick fame is partially because of the notability of two members in the band. Dylan Minnette and Brain the Masters are both actors and were before they created Wallows. Dylan Minnette has acted in things like Goosebumps, 13 Reasons Why, and the new Scream. Brain the Masters has had a smaller career with his claims to fame being a guest on Criminal Minds and NCIS and a regular on the show Tagged. Overall, the familiarity of their names and faces in Hollywood brought interest and attention to the new band. The band signed with Atlantic Records and released their first EP, labeled Spring, on April 6, 2018. However, it was about a year later that things really started to pick up for them, with the drop of their debut album, Nothing Happens, on March 22, 2019. The song, Are You Bored Yet?, that appeared on the album peaked at number two on the Billboard American Alternative Airplay chart and reached double platinum certification by the Recording Industry Association of America. It isn't just their music or their notability that makes them so popular. It is also their personalities and actions. On their Nothing Happens tour, they partnered with local nonprofit charities in each city. The nonprofit we were working with there apparently was five months worth of their supplies that was brought to the show last night. The band also uses their social media in a way that makes the fans feel connected to them. It is clear that the popularity of Wallows is only growing as well as their discography, as they have just recently released their sophomore album, Tell Me That's Over, on March 25, 2022.